welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome if you're not welcome back and let's get into today's vlog so today's monday which means i'm not doing hair mondays are like my off day and i just kind of wind down but i have a pilates class in like 25 minutes and i'm not gonna i need to leave now because it's like a 25 minute walk number one number two i can't lie when i woke up today i just wasn't feeling in the mood to do any exercise i'm not supposed to do any exercise on monday because that's my chill day like mondays are my rest days sundays and mondays are my rest days but mondays are really my rest days but i booked a class for today so i've got to go it's not the same teacher i had last time so that's why i'm a bit like eh. I don't know how these teachers are like you know some of them be having you do a whole gym session in the Pilates room like but you know what I'm gonna go why because I said I was gonna go and I am not disappointing myself this year I feel like sometimes we're so comfortable with disappointing ourselves like we said we're gonna do this and we don't do it because we could do it tomorrow today is tomorrow so I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna go that's my only exercise for the day like I'm not doing any gym today today is just a Pilates session for 45 minutes I'm sure I can do it so I'm gonna go I have on a Cassell set fresh grey set like because selfish was just so comfortable and why not wear it to pilates i have on my ugg tasmans as well and i got on my yoga socks but you guys will see that at pilates i'm not taking my camera but i will get some clips for you so yeah let's go to pilates today i don't have a jam-packed day but i do have a few things i want to do like i want to cut this wig into a fringe i need to return a parcel a haul so i need to check those items but it hasn't arrived yet but it's gonna arrive today that's enough of me blabbling on girl i need to go to pilates <laughs> can't lie that session was something like i genuinely wasn't mentally ready for that session like before when i woke up i was like oh, i don't feel like going i went and i had my session tomorrow i've got another pilates session but before pilates tomorrow i will have a workout so i'll get that done today i have a few little errands so i need to go hygiene shopping i need to drop off a parcel i've got this revolve return that i really need to drop off because i've had it for so long and i said i would do it and i haven't so i need to do that i also need to go to my studio because i need to collect some straighteners all my straighteners are at my studio uh no comprehende like all my straighteners like, i've got like five straighteners in it all at my studio so i need to go and collect my straighteners today bring one home also need to drop some stuff to my studio i'm not working today mondays are my off day so i need to do that and i also need to clean my room my room is a mess girl i also have some deliveries coming today i hope they come today amazon's been taking the mickey with my deliveries like they haven't been coming and i'm confused i don't understand that i also need to plan out my content for the week i need to journal today i didn't journal today so i have to do that later it's kind of jam-packed but it's not that jam-packed but it will be a good lengthy vlog because i'm not sure comment down below if you guys like 20 minute 30 minute or 40 minute vlogs someone come and say i like an hour I like oh my days i think 30 minutes is the average i try to stay under 30 minutes now i used to do the 50 minutes and the 40 minutes but i don't know comment down below what you would prefer anyways yes yeah, so that's what i have to do also i'm just irritated because i need some longer jackets like oh my gosh i'm actually over the crop jacket and the short jacket thing like i don't know like my bum cheeks were so cold walking down the street and you know you can feel people looking at you like i'm not someone where, like i don't like people looking at me anyway i can't lie like i just get a bit what but when I'm walking down the street, I don't care because I'm just quickly passing by. So it doesn't bother me. But today, it kind of bothered me, like... 
I don't know. And especially because I'm wearing grey leggings as well. You know, grey, you can really see. Like, black, you can't really... Like, black, you can see, but grey, you can really see. So, I was just kind of annoyed by that. Like, Angela, you need some long jackets. And the crazy thing is, I'm actually creating a capsule. So, I've got, like, a few things that I want to, like, put in my clothing capsule. So, I need to start ticking them off one by one. But as you can see, it literally says creating a clothing capsule and i've got like a few things there that i want to get and one of them is trench coat long wool coat long long rain jacket long hooded cardigan like yeah i got some sneakers on there footwear jeans pants jumper tops like i'm trying to start a new capsule because this capsule i got right here girl i need some more stuff literally but anyways that's what we're doing today nothing too fancy honestly just kind of just doing my little errands spacey errands i would like to call it um i also want to cut a fringe wig yesterday i was watching Peyton marie charles on youtube and she always wears a fringe wig like that's her signature and i said i have a closure that is clean jet black it's not it's not damaged let me turn that into a fringe so i'm gonna do that today and because my hair's cut now it's the perfect time to put just put a fringe on and hibernate away no eyebrows no edges on show but the thing is i'm going out in Feb and March so I won't be wearing that wig of course but anyway let's get into today's vlog I don't know which one I'm gonna do first but let's let's go do my errands so I've arrived at my destination I'm outside boots there's even somewhere I need to go over there as well because I want to get a notebook I don't really need a notebook I have a lot but I want to get another notebook and some highlighters as well um, and maybe a pack of pens depends what I see I can't I need to use the toilet I don't know why I drank I drank like almost a full Stanley before I left I don't know why I done that because now I'm bursting I'm gonna go and grab some hygiene stuff I need some deodorant I need some wipes let me see what else I need I, you know I made a list because I always make a list I need some deodorant I need some wipes I need some razors if they have nair i'll get that too i need some toothpaste i have toothpaste at home but the one my mom buys is the one in the squidgy tube and for some reason i don't like that one i like the toothpaste that's in the hard tube that stands up by itself don't ask me why i'm like that that's just the one i prefer and i prefer crystal gels i don't like the one that's red white and blue like that i don't know why i'm like that i'm gonna grab some body wash i have a lot of body wash but i just want another body wash because hygiene shopping isn't hygiene shopping about body wash um and any other extras i guess i'll just grab them put them in the basket i am just doing a little quick montage i will get the journal and the highlighters as well i do need to go to the toilet so that's why i'm talking really fast but i'll catch you guys in a second literally <laughs> I'm in TK Maxx. This body tape like caught my eye. I don't even like lavender, but when I saw this one on the shelf just now, I felt like like I feel like I had to pick it up. I think it's really nice. It's supposed to be like that. But I won't, I'll get a different one. I think you just shake it up. I saw this and I was like, ooh, this looks nice. I want to really try other body washes. Not every day the same body wash every time. Like, I think this one might be really, really nice. This looks so good as well. Sugar, body scrub. Um, what's flavor? Flavor. What's the scent? Chicken bone green apple. I think this looks really nice. I'm trying to try other stuff and... I don't know, these little random things are just catching my eye. I did come in here for Tree Hut, but let me see. Even this one is well behind. Lime and coconut. I'm gonna smell them though, because I haven't smelled them, so I'm gonna smell these. And as well, it's catching my eye. Citrus. No, I don't like citrus. I don't like citrus. That's one thing. I don't like citrus. No. But I am gonna give those body scrubs a smell. But like I said, I did come in here for Tree Hut, so I'm gonna have a look to see if I see any Tree Hut. have all these stanley type dupes which they're still nice they're, they're not a dupe it's just a hydro flask okay it's a sippy cup but yeah they have all of these i think this is the nicest one but i don't like much of them i don't like the red like i don't i don't know i don't like it it's not cute like why can't we just have it like america like they have all the nice ones i think this one is quite nice the color is nice but i wouldn't buy that color personally they're not ugly they even got gray ones down here 
It's cute, like the top is cute, but it ain't a Stanley, ain't it? Like, I don't understand why the UK just can't catch up. Like, why are we so behind? Like, we're just too behind. This one's okay, very girly, but I ain't buying none of this. Like, this is not what I want at all, not at all okay so i am done running around the time is 2 53 almost 3 p.m i haven't had lunch i am kind of hungry what did i have today i had a lick of water before i got to pilates i didn't eat nothing before pilates because like i said like i was pondering around like i was like oh do i want to go do i want to go uh, i didn't even eat anything then after pilates i had a milkshake no not a milkshake i had a smoothie i had a strawberry banana apple juice and whey protein smoothie from the calf in the gym and that's all i've had Oh, I am a bit hungry right now. I kind of wanted to go to Greg's and get a sausage roll quickly and then have my dinner later because it's quite light. But then I kind of want Subway. <laughs> The man looked like he wanted to laugh. I don't know if it was her son or what. Wow. Old lady nearly dropped and bust her front head right there on the pavement. And my face was straight, but the man looked like he wanted to laugh. Like, and the man she was with looked like her son. He looked like he wanted to bust up. Like, and you know, it wasn't even her fault. It's windy. <laughs> I'm not laughing at her, but you know the wind, like when the wind really has power against you, you're actually going down. Like, she stood her ground still. <laughs> I got my sub. I didn't get no sides, no fizzy drink, no no cookies, no crisps, no nothing, girl. I just got my little six inch sub. I'm making a change because old me would have got some white cookies, a fizzy drink, like. But this is still like it's it's semi healthy. It's still semi unhealthy because of the sauce and stuff. But it's still healthier than other options, should I say? And like I said, I'm just changing my options, making a change. I'm not trying to wake up and be skinny tomorrow that's not what i'm aiming for as per usual i got an italian bmt with italian herbs and cheese bread because that's just like my favorite bread like i don't know what it is red onion red pepper cucumber gherkins lettuce got hot sauce like very hot sauce i got barbecue and i got sweet onion that's all i got that's it y'all that's it I'm gonna quickly eat this, then I need to go and drop my parcel off, then go to my studio. I'll probably pick you guys up once about my studio. I don't even know where I'm gonna drop this parcel off. Just know that that revolve return needs to go back today. Ooh, look at this car! Oh my god. I need this car. Wow. Look at the oh. To my right, yeah, this is like a car that I really want. And it's just gone into the right lane, but it was it's been next to me for the past. 20 to 30 minutes right and well it was in front of me now it's just gone next to me listen i i'm going back to the gym tonight i'm going back to the gym i'm going to work so hard in the gym like i can't lie to you guys like when you want something everything in your life has to align like, well that's just what i think some people disagree like you can get it when you get it but i believe when you want something in your life yeah everything in your life has to align in order to receive it well and to receive it fully and to receive it as yours not temporary it's it's fully yours and like oh that car to myself what does the person that drives that well me what does my future what does me in the future angeline cause do when she's driving that car what does she look like like how does she act what does she say like how does she speak and it just said i don't know it, it, I, basically i came down to the thought of going to the gym like I, I don't know what it is like i don't know because what does my future angeline do like she's a content creator she's a business owner she is an entrepreneur she's a woman of god she's a woman of influence and respectfully in the most humble way i'm kind of those things now but obviously building myself up of course like i'm not in no grand scheme or nothing like that but i'm basically that now i'm just building myself up but the only aspect of things that are not as strong, I would say, is my faith, which is why I'm going back to church. And I'm getting back into my faith and, like, really going to, like, do this one properly and take it very seriously. And then number two is how I look and what I do on a daily. Like, my daily habits have to change and I'm currently working on changing them right now. And then how I look, which is the gym and being healthy and stuff like that, like, making good de decisions, making good decisions about what I put in my body, food, drink, vitamins, substances, anything like that and then 
you know being fit and stuff like that and i just i saw that car like i was driving behind it for like 20 to 35 minutes and i was just saying i need this car 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 how am i gonna get this car what do i need to do to get this car like i need to act a certain way i need to breathe a certain way i need to think a certain way my pockets need to be a certain way like life just needs to be a certain way before i even think about getting this car like i could be ready to get this car i could be ready to buy this car tomorrow but i might ready to receive this car am i ready to upkeep this car I'm ready to like like listen once i get that new car is a certain energy that exudes from me personally this is just for me some people don't care about me sorry i want to dress i want to act a routine where i go i'm not taking my good nice car because the car was like 30 40 000. like i'm not taking that car just anywhere do you know what i mean like a lot of things have to change i'm working on it i'm working on it i'm telling you guys i'm working on it i'm telling you and if you see it then thank you because i'm telling you i am but you know there's still a lot of drastic changes that could be made and it just means discipline like even when i was in pilates yeah i'm telling you i couldn't do the the last move like the last move is always the killer because you're already tired your legs is giving way but I did it, I pulled through and I held the pose, I did the plank. So, my thought basically is I am going back to the gym tonight and I'm gonna work. I didn't actually do a gym session this morning, of course. I just went to Pilates, but I'm going to the gym. I'm going to do treadmill. I'm going to do that 3, 30, um, 12 minute, 12, 12 incline, three speed or four speed, 30 minutes. I'm going to do my floor workouts. I'm going to do my sit-ups. I'm going to do my pull-ups. Oh, pull-ups is a bit, mm, not pull-ups, it's a lap pull, that's it. I'm going to do my full workout routine. I'm going to leave there sweating. I had Subway. I'm not going to snack tonight. Today I'm going to have salmon with potatoes and salad. Maybe no potatoes, just salmon and salad. My water, no snacks. Tomorrow I've got gym. I've got Pilates again. I'm going to have my gym session, then Pilates. Um, and yeah, I'm sticking to it now, man, because driving behind that car, like, wow. Life I want is not too far. The only thing that stops me and probably a lot of you guys from the life you want is consistency and if you are a consistent person but you don't know what you want then it's the lack of failure fear of failure and the fear of people seeing them fail because that's a lot of people's problem the fear of people seeing them try is like putting them off there's only two reasons consistency and the and the, and the feel of failure sorry for the start the feel of failure and I, I don't have the feel of failure i don't like you see me start things and it didn't work and i moved on i'm not a feel of failure person like if i fail i fail i think for me it's consistency but i think i've been quite consistent but when you when you're consistent you need to produce good things as well you can't just produce rubbish and then expect to say oh but i'm showing up no but you're showing up with bullshit. you need to show up properly i saw it go anyways i'm on my way home i'm gonna do a haul of everything i got freshen up put my gym clothes on take my pre-workout take my creatine i think i've got creatine or my i don't know what i have um yeah i'll drink my greens when i come back i should have drank it in the morning and i'm gonna go to the gym babe like listen to my tunes that get me pumped because there ain't no jazz music in the gym in the gym is some music that is making me uns 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 like <laughs> I am still thinking about that car. I think I'm gonna say as my wallpaper because I need to, like everything I do needs to relate back to that car. And I'm not even trying to be a materialistic person, but you know when there's something you want and you know you're gonna work for it, that's how I feel about that car. I need to clean my camera like properly, but like with soap and water. Anyway, let me quickly show you what I got today. I'm just gonna do a quick haul of everything that I just kind of picked up. Um, I'm also waiting for some deliveries, but I'll talk about it in a second. I just received a big haul because I'm gonna do a dedicated haul. I might do it tomorrow, actually. Um, it's from White Fox Boutique, so I'm excited, girl. I'm gonna like quickly show you like what the box and stuff, but yeah, I might do that content tomorrow because I'm a content creator, I need to get it done. So I done my small little hygiene shop in Boots. I usually do it in Superdrug, but I kind of like, I don't have dedicated places to do it because we don't live in the US. Well, I don't live in the US. I know some of you do, but we don't got like Target, Ulta, and places you could do like a full hygiene shop because I was watching someone's vlog and they did a Target hygiene shop and Target had everything. We don't have somewhere like that. Like we got Beats, we got Super Drug, but the shelves are always empty. Like we're just missing so much products. Like when I went into TK Maxx, I was looking for Tree Heart and I was looking for this coffee and scrub wash. They didn't have any of that. Like 
unfortunately but anyway i picked up a few little items so let me show you so first i picked up some pads this is for when i'm on my cycle i like wingless pads that's just me personally i know, I know some people like the ones with wings are like jumbo but when i'm when I, when my cycle comes it's quite light and is like barely there so this is perfect we also picked up some panty liners please don't think panty liners are only for when you're on like your cycle or just coming off you should be wearing them quite often for like discharge and like things like that i picked up some toothpaste this is the toothpaste that i like i like the ooh, i like the toothpaste in the tube i love when it's in the tube and i love when it's the crystal blue like oh i don't know what it is it just it's just aesthetically pleasing like why do i want that squeezy tube where there's bare toothpaste at the top no i also picked up some baby wipes i use baby wipes in the toilet i use them for my face i use them to clean stuff like these are like multi-use like definitely but i usually use them to take off my makeup i like to put my makeup oil remover and then wipe my makeup off and then wash my face that's just how I like to do it. I picked up some bath soak. So originally I picked up the other one, the other Radox, but this one just smelled a lot better. So I like to use a bar of soap and then use this. Now I know it's bath soak, but it definitely lovers up like shower gel. Don't let no one tell you that you can't be using bath soak or shower gel because you can. Yeah, this one smells quite good. I'm not gonna lie, when I first smelled it, I was like, oh, this is not really my thing because I don't like ginseng. But when I kept smelling it, I was like, oh, this is nice. This is nice, like yeah this is fresh it was it, you could tell it will last on your skin i also popped into tk maxx i picked up two items i picked up this wash this is a body wash it's called savon and it's a lavender shower gel this looks so aesthetically pleasing that's that's mainly why i picked up i'm not gonna lie but this looks so aesthetically pleasing like i really like it i might buy it again and it was 6.99 i feel like this is all right for 6.99 then i also picked up this scrub this is what's this called i also picked up the scrub by omshi aromatherapy in lime and coconut listen this smells so nice and i saw this i was like mm, i don't really like coconut smell and lime like mm, but the, together this smells so nice I would definitely buy this again. And what I like about this scrub is it's an actual scrub. Like, I know you can't see the consistency, but it's an actual scrub. I hate scrubs that say it's a scrub and it's rubbish. Like, it, I need to feel the, the salt on my skin. I need to feel the scrub on my skin. I also picked up Mitchum deodorant. I actually have some in my drawer, but I just wanted to top up as well. So I love Mitchum. Listen, if you are struggling with underarms that are a bit sour, Mitchum is your best friend. I remember I told a few people in my vlog about Mitchum like years ago and they still use it till this day. They still tell me they still use Mitchum because Mitchum is very, very, very good for the underarms. You can't be a hot girl and your underarms are sour because it, it just doesn't work. Like, it just doesn't. Also picked up a notebook and a pen. This is the notebook that I picked up from uh, Poundland and it has like a little B on the front in gold, which I think is cute. I also picked up this gold pen that has a B on it, which I think is super, super cute as well. Like it's like a set. And obviously this notebook is mainly for content. Like when I'm editing, um, I need to make notes. Um, so that's mainly what this one's for. This one's kind of for work. And also this is not something I picked up recently, but this is my six minute diary that I want to start filling in every morning now i do fill it in but it's not in the morning i just fill out when i see it i'm not gonna lie but i want a morning ritual when i wake up and i fill this in i read the word like i'm i'm tapping into my higher self and i'm making it a sturdy routine that is here to stay not for the aesthetics not for like oh because it's trending no this is what i want so yeah this is gonna stay on my desk my notebook my journal and then my bible when it comes because i actually ordered the bible i have a bible in my house but i wanted to order my own and then i also ordered a bible study this dog is just don't jump on anything i also ordered a bible study as well let me actually show you what i've ordered because i've ordered a few things that are actually on the way so i ordered a tripod as well because the tripod i have <laughs> let me show you obviously on my camera i have a tripod i need to order a new one because this one is like it's too short now and it's wobbly like it's just it's, it's ran its course but this was the actual tripod i was using for tiktoks look at the tape listen i was using this to get my my tiktoks out and they were doing just fine but i needed a new tripod so i ordered one um that comes on wednesday i kind of needed it to come tomorrow but i guess i'll just make do with one of my tripods um for tomorrow because i do kind of want to record the content tomorrow so yeah i also ordered a hand cream i ordered the laocetane hand cream i know people say like on tiktok they be saying like but i ordered the 
Le Occitane. I'm gonna ask my mom how to say it because she's French. I really could have got this in the store. I could have like went to um, White City and done like a shopping spree and got it, but I just really wanted to buy it because I'm also thinking about getting a new bag. I've got a lot of bags, but I really want a new bag and I want a new everyday bag. I'm trying to give myself a new everyday bag and I don't know what everyday bag I want. So for, for my 10K, cause I reached 10K scene, I want to get myself a new bag, a nice bag, a bag, okay? A bag that's like, okay. Oh yeah, I'm trying to buy things to put in my bag. I know that's weird, some of us are actually weird, but I like my bag to have everything I need. I want it to have nice stuff in there. I don't like cluttered bags. I don't like bags with bare dust in them and stuff like that. So yeah, I, this dog. Yeah, I'm thinking about a new bag and I want to start buying things to put in my bag, basically. I also ordered the spray for work and I ordered the Bible and the Bible study. I'll show you the Bible that I ordered. It's just a white um, King James Version Bible. This is literally the Bible that I ordered. Nothing too fancy, just very simple. Um, but I ordered it in white because I wanted it in white. So it's going to take long because I wanted to get it in white. I ordered a woman's study Bible, which is like you can write notes in it and stuff like that. So when I'm doing my Bible study, I can write my notes down. This is the woman's study Bible that I ordered. Oh, I don't like how this is not focusing, I'm so sorry. But yeah, that's also what I ordered. I also ordered some curtains for my studio. I really hope those come on Wednesday because I'm gonna be with Natasha on Wednesday and you know she's more handier than me. I'm handy, but Natasha is handy, child. So I really want her to put up the curtains in my studio. I ordered two swing bins as well because I'll show you guys in my next vlog, but basically, not my next vlog, Holy Wednesday, but basically, that portable sink that I got, yeah, those buckets that it comes with are not big enough for water. Unfortunately, like, sometimes I'll be just about running out of water or doing someone's hair. Like, I make it work, but at the end of, like, when I'm just rinsing out the condition, I can see the water's going and I actually need more than I think. So I ordered two swing bins because that's what they said you should do and I can't, like, it's very smart. Yeah, I also ordered a skipping rope as well because I need skipping for gym. I want to do 10 minutes of skipping every day. So, yeah, but, oh, guys, I'm in such a good mood. I'm so pumped to go to the gym. Gonna take off my wig, put on my headscarf. I'm gonna go. And I'm also making a TikTok as well. So I've got Cashew. I'm also making a TikTok as well. So I've gotten enough content for my TikTok. I'm just gonna end out the night by going to the gym, coming home, doing my hair. I don't really have much hair to do, but I'm gonna come home. I don't really have much hair to do. You didn't close the door behind you, babe. I'm home and straighten that wig and cut a fringe because I really want a fringe and then prepare for tomorrow because tomorrow I wanna film content and I might do another vlog, so yeah. Um, I also picked up my straighteners at work and I also picked up my heat protectant. This is my heat protectant that's coming with Cause Beauty Studio. Listen, I'm on a hair journey and the products I'm gonna use are gonna be my own. Thank you very much. So once we see some growth and some changes in my natural hair, then you know that my products, you can vouch for them, child. I know that's right. That's what we got going on. Let me show you quickly. I'm just gonna quickly show you what I got from White Fox because I can't be bothered to do a haul right now. The haul is for tomorrow, okay? Ta-da! Okay, I'm just quickly going to run through what I got. I might not even open everything because there's a lot, like, there's clothes. I'm sure there's like two pieces in, yeah, there's definitely like two, three pieces in each. Let's see what else. Wow. Wow. There's definitely a lot though. What's this? Is this a special box? What's in here? Ooh, I'm gonna open this one. Ooh, I don't wanna open these now. You're gonna Cashew, babe. Do you mind, darling? I think she feels left out. Okay, you can go in the box. Anyway, so yeah, yeah, she felt left out. I'm gonna just wait till the haul because I'm gonna film a dedicated haul. Um, I'm gonna try everything on in the video and then I'll like show, the, I, like I'm gonna do a nice haul, okay? So we'll wait for the haul, but I'm gonna open that box now because I don't know what's in that box and it's just, I'm kind of curious, so let's see. I'm actually interested to know what's in this box. It might be one of the items I selected, but I feel like it's something else. It's got a ribbon and ooh. Ooh. What's in the mystery box? What's in the mystery box, box, box? What's in the mystery box? What's in the mystery box, box? I want to take a picture of the box, box. What's in the mystery box, box? What's in the mystery box, box? What's in the mystery... Cashew, what's in the mystery box? Box, what's in the mystery box? Ooh, oh, it's clothes. 
is it closed yeah it's like tops okay then i got a card it says hey babe we can't wait to see when your new white fox pieces and hope you love them as much as we do make sure you tag at white fox boutique so we can see you in your new looks this is the card like hey babe <laughs> hey that's so nice their presentation's like tea i can't lie like tea hey i'm gonna open this now yeah these are clothes oh this is nice look at this dress so are these like extras or something these aren't this is nice stretchy yeah yeah you okay put these back in the box though because there's there's a difference that these are in the box and those are in the bag so i'm gonna put these back in the box i got a dress is nice oh this material this is a bandu dress i remember seeing this this is so sexy like i'd wear these with tights it's like a bandu dress and you wear it like this and it's stretchy it's a bit short but i probably wear it with tights i don't know what shoes but the looks are coming girl and then there's a t-shirt in here like a everyday t-shirt which i've been needing because i could wear this like out um to the gym you know things like that oh god there's more t-shirts more t -sh okay 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 another long sleeve t-shirt here and i've been needing plain t-shirts too like and they're stretchy guys you don't know how much of a big deal this is that they're stretchy and they're my size I have another t-shirt this is a com oh this cut this quality i don't know like I don't know what type of quality this is, but this is like, this feels lush. But this is a comfort club t-shirt. I think I got the bottoms to match this one as well. So that's nice, very stretchy. It's like a cropped kind of top. The quality on this one is very nice though. The last thing in the box is this silk dress, which is black. Tiny stretch, but it's my size, so I'm not fussed. This is how it looks. Oh, this is sexy. Oh, this is my type of style. This is like the era. And imagine like a nice hairstyle with the bow. Ah, la, 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 la. I'm happy. Oh my God, this is so lush. Cashew, do you want to wear it, babe? And this is how it's like wide around the waist. And you know, I don't have no big waist, but I got big hips. Woo, I can't wait to wear this. I can't wait to wear this. Thank you, White Fox Boutique. I can't wait to do this haul now. Like, yeah. I'm in a great mood. These look good already. I haven't opened the ones in a bag, of course. There's a pair of heels in there as well. But looking at this, this looks amazing. I'm going to quickly fold back these items that came in the box. And then when I get home from the gym, I'll really, like, go through it properly. Um, and just make sure that, like, I'm happy with everything that I have here. But these look so good. And, like, a lot of them are sets as well. And I've been wanting new sets. Especially to, like, travel in or go shopping in or go to the gym. Like, I think sets is the easiest way to look put together. Well, your hair done as well. Because once your hair's done, you'll look put together. But when you wear sets and your hair's done, automatically you look put together. That's a major tip in, like, anyone's glow-up journey. Like, focus on getting some sets and creating, like, a clothing... This girl's making too much noise. And creating like a clothing capsule because I'm working on a clothing capsule. I think I showed you like a little screen of it this morning, but I'm really working on a clothing capsule. So oh, the quality of this top is too nice. Like, how do I even tell you what material? Do I have to go on the website or something? Because the material, this material is 80% nylon and 20% spandex. Most t-shirts are not like that. Like, ooh, yeah, I'm excited. I'm feeling so good now because honestly like honestly like I'm thankful because I've been wanting to work with White Fox I see all my favorite influencers American ones work with White Fox and I'm like oh my god I want to work with them but I thought they wouldn't work with me I don't know why like then I saw an email I was like hold on a minute let me check that and I was so happy like yeah it, things are things are picking up you know you just have to put the work in and I'm feeling blessed. I know it's just the clothing brand to some people, but to me, it's White Fox Boutique. And I'm thankful that they're working with me. Thankful to be getting sponsored by White Fox Boutique. Can't wait to do that video. Can't wait to wear these outfits. Yeah, I'm in a great mood. I'm just gonna get ready for the gym. I'll probably see you guys at the gym. Am I gonna vlog the gym today? Because I plan to vlog, vlog the gym tomorrow. So I don't think I'm gonna vlog the gym.
Okay, guys, it's a lot later. I went to the gym, had my shower, did my night routine. I used that new scrub that I showed you from TK Maxx. Amazing. I used the new wash as well. Smells lush. I'm ready for bed, but before I go to bed, I actually need to do my hair. So like I said, I had that closure wig. I really want to turn it into a fringe wig, so I'm going to do that. I'm just going to cut some bangs, straighten out, and like make it really cute. But yes, I'm in bed right now. I had a good day. I'm really upset that I didn't get to do the vision board. And the reason being is because I realised I don't have a board to do the vision board on, like, and I don't have glue so I need to get either a print stick glue or some pins or something I kind of want to get push pins and like my whole theory was get some push pins and then when I've like achieved something on that vision board or I feel like I've like done something on the vision board or, or something like that take off the picture but then at the end of the year I want to reflect on the vision board and see everything on there and have been done that or had that so I think I might leave it I also might do my vision board on a picture of me so like I have these big canvases in my office I might do my vision board like glue the pictures onto that picture because I feel like it makes sense in my head like Behind all of the vision is me, the mastermind, and it just makes sense. I don't know, that's just me, but this will probably be in my next vlog. Maybe not tomorrow's vlog, but my another vlog because I need to get the print stick and I just don't have time tomorrow. But yeah, I'm going to do that wig because I need to get like me a good everyday wig, child. My room is a mess. I'm not going to lie to you because of the unboxing, but you guys will see that in another video. There'll be a White Fox haul look out for that girl i just finished editing a tiktok on this vlog so basically i vlogged for tiktok and youtube i really enjoyed today i feel like i got a lot done um i feel like i had a good day by myself like as per usual anyway but yeah, i'm feeling content like i just checked my emails as well and there's like a few collabs in there of things that i've been wanting so you know that's really nice but yeah i'm in a great mood i'm gonna do my wig and then that will be the end of the vlog let's get started mm -hmm. I feel like this is a good hairstyle if you want to like hide away like it's a good everyday wig if you want to hide away I do need some lashes I can actually bring the wig down a bit if I wanted the fringe like to really stop on my eyes I kind of want the fringe fringe I can't say that word kind of want the fringe thinner so I'm gonna keep like plucking it um it's getting quite thin which is good I cut a bit of layers here because I just felt like it just added a bit of something I don't know what I felt like it added I ain't seen myself in a fridge in a fridge why do I keep calling it a fridge I ain't seen myself with a fringe in ages I'm kind of digging it comment down below what you think I think it's good like a quick run around everyday wig I think it's all right um yeah and it's jet black as well I just think the fringe needs to be a lot thinner um and probably shorter a little bit but other than that like i think it's good for a little 10 minute diy yeah i just need to work on the side because like the side is giving Nicki minaj like barbie <laughs> barbie <laughs> i think it's cute like a cute every day but i'm getting hot already with this fringe on oh, my days like i'm getting hot i just gotta keep plucking it because i want it a little thinner on the sides but that's the end of it girl i needed a little wig i can run around in i won't be wearing this to the gym because i'll be hot so i'm happy i'm gonna end my night by writing in my journal um i'm using a six minute diary from amazon it's really good actually i'm gonna show you let me show you what's in it quickly okay so there's this beginning page and this is the quote on the beginning page i feel like stuff like that really make you want to journal like i really love things like that but let me show you a page where i haven't written on yet okay yeah this is the page i haven't written on yet and it says i'm grateful for this is how i make today great a positive affirmation my good deed today how i'll improve great things i experienced today and there's every quote you can think of on every page literally there's a quote right there 
So all every page that you write on, there's a little quote. And I feel like that's so good because it will motivate you to want to write in your journal. Um, I definitely think everyone should journal. But yeah, I'm going to finish in my journal and that's going to be me for tonight. I've already edited the TikTok. I need to edit this vlog, babes. I will see you guys in my next vlog. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Comment down below if this wig is given or if it's not. <laughs> Let me know. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Mwah. Good night.